Hey, it's So Hollywood. I'm Lainey. And I'm Lisa. And we're back. Okay, I'm so <laughs> I'm sorry that you wouldn't say that. This is just the story that will not go away. Um, we went down to the beach to get away from the business for a while and have some lunch in Santa Monica. And in walks the Terminator. Actually, he was walking out when we were walking in. Right. We don't know who he lunched with, but what we do know is that there's some big news today. Both Arnie and Maria have lawyered up. They've gotten some big guns um, to represent them. So, so yeah, Maria has um, has hired Laura Wasser, who is notoriously um, a big Hollywood name when it comes to divorces. She also loves the limelight. She was in Vanity Fair. She goes into court with her Manolos. I, I have had personal experience with Laura. And uh, did she represent you? No. no. I mean, I wish. I mean, it, not that I. I mean, it's only <laughs> high-profile cases, but she is a killer. Arnold is being represented by Robert Kaufman, who is a big-time Hollywood attorney. Jennifer, he, you know, he was the attorney for Jennifer Aniston, for Blake Brad Pitt, um, Reese Witherspoon, and Jessica, Jessica Simpson. Yeah. He's worth a pretty penny here, but you know, this is a big divorce. This is like uh, Arnold is worth like five hundred million dollars. So the next couple of weeks, we here, should have had him take us to lunch. <laughs> we should have done something. I don't know. Uh, no, no, I don't know. I wonder how people are dealing with him like that. Like when Bernie Madoff was walking in the streets, people were horrible. I don't know if they're doing that to him. I'm sure people are saying stuff, but we just kind of kept our heads low. And the other big news is that is that there was no DNA taken yet. I mean, right, right. What's the story with that? Well, I think that when we we thought that was odd, and we found out that apparently the baby mama had even made. Um, has attested to the fact that her husband was out of the country during the conception of the baby. So, hello, I mean, I guess you don't need I mean, you, you've seen those photos on, like, you know, all the entertainment shows. You know, it's blurred out. But that child, first of all, does not look Latin very much. I mean, he's got lighter hair, and he's got that jaw. I know. The total recall jaw. Oh, my God. <laughs> and thinking. I have to say, though, that it, what's surprising to us is that even, like, the men's men in Hollywood, they're really down on Arnold. I mean, Bill Maher this week on um, Real Time, he was tough. What did he say? He was like making jokes that were just over the top in, in relentless about how could he possibly do this to his wife, which I think is kind of interesting from a guy who's a total dog, you know what I mean? Now, everyone in town is talking about, did she know? When did they find right. out? I mean, it's like, you know, we people don't know. But, I mean, I, I think she might have known for a while. Oh, see, I don't, I totally disagree. So, I mean, you can let us know if you agree with Lisa or with me, but I don't How think How could you could... not? I mean, she came, he came to all the little parties, and he look, doesn't look like... I think when you don't want to know something, you, I, I don't... I want to I go into a bathing suit this summer. I don't want to know that my vows... <laughs> So I'm you're there. saying she may have known, but didn't want to admit it? I think Is that what you're saying? Yeah. I don't, I, I, mean, I, I don't think you even know enough to know that you don't know. I mean, it's like, well, one thing's for sure, he knew. And, yeah, and that kind of sucks. And I got to say that, really, Bill Maher's jokes were horrible. One of them was, this is a cyborg that really should have gone back into history to prevent the birth of this child. I mean, seriously? Or that the kid, they should have known when the kid put salsa on his tits. <laughs> It's I bad. mean, the jokes are just never going to end, but we will keep you up to date with everything Arnold and Maria, and let us know what you think about the situation. That's it for It's So Hollywood, and remember, it's more than just celebrities, it's a lifestyle. See ya! Bye-bye!